Hello, guys. In this lesson, we're going to talk about starting a live stream on Creator Studio. Let's get started. You can live stream on your Facebook page using Creator Studio. You can live stream news broadcasts, events, gaming, talk shows, interviewing people live, streaming educational videos, or selling products live. Live videos are more likely to show up on news feeds, which increases the chances of attracting more audiences to watch your live streaming video and engage with your brand in real time. It also increases engagement where people can react, comment during the live stream, and also share your live stream video. To start a live stream, go to Creator Studio. On the Home tab, you can see the Go Live option. You'll be redirected to the Live Producer page. This is the new Live Producer design. It is also possible to switch back to the previous version of Live Producer. On the left side menu, you may notice that you can choose the options to go live or schedule a live video event. Below, you can create a test broadcast before going live. The test broadcast will only be visible to page admins and editors, then allow Facebook to use your microphone and your camera. Next, select a video source. If you're going to use your laptop's camera, the camera controls will have the settings for your laptop, then set the default microphone to use for your live stream. You can use the option Start Screen Share so that your viewers can also view your screen and show them what you're doing as you go live. This is useful for videos that will show people a demonstration of tutorials. If you enable to show live tab on page, anyone who visits your page will be able to see your live videos in the live tab. Below is the URL for your live videos tab. Click next. Craft the title of your live stream and say something about the video. These details are required. Next, you have the option to share it to pages groups and select the group where you want the live streaming video to appear. Then click save. This allows you to have more audiences to watch your live video from the members of that group. You can also add a group to promote, which adds a call to action button to promote a group that you manage. Click the audience settings. You can set a minimum age that you will allow to watch your live stream video. If you don't want to add restrictions, you can set it to public. Next, you can allow selected locations to view your live streaming video. You can also restrict selected locations so that people from these locations will not view your live stream. Under gaming, you can stream gameplay from multiple screens or cameras, then tag a game in this text field. Click Next. Under the dashboard, you can view your live video, insights, goals, feature checklist, including share to pages groups, and publish a poll. Polls will be available during your live video, and your audiences can answer the questions that you will set here. As you set the options, you can mark the correct answer as you click on this check mark. If you need more options, you can add them here, then click Save. All the questions for the polls will be available here. Under Settings, you can set the stream settings, such as ending the live video if the stream stops, set the stream latency, embed the live video so that you can insert your live video on any website, and under Viewer, you can set the option to allow viewers to rewind your live video if they haven't seen the first part of your live video. Under Comments, you can allow all viewers to participate in chat, only your followers will be able to leave comments, restrict commenters to comment only every 10 seconds, to comment only every 10 seconds, or any user can only comment if their accounts are at least two weeks old, which prevents people to create a new account only to spam your live video. Under Interactivity, you can edit your polls, add questions, graphics, and prompts. Prompts allow you to feature a link on your live video and let your viewers know about your website or to raise money through a third-party platform. Write a description of your link and add a website link below, then click Save. Now we can start the test live streaming. You can see if the video plays right during the live test broadcast. All the viewers who comment on our live video will be shown in this section. Once you end the live video, you can rate your broadcast quality and choose what went wrong, such as audio problems, delay or lagging, or low engagement. You also have the option to view the post, trim your video, or create a clip from your live video. If you want to schedule the live video event, click this option. You'll be redirected to this page, then type in the event name. Next, set the start date and the start time, then add a description. You can set a stream key and copy this stream key into your streaming software. 
You can also enable paid access to allow users to view your live video only if they have purchased access to your live video. You can earn money with paid online events where your fans can enjoy premium content while they gather virtually. Submit this button to request paid access for this live event. Set the price, then you can set an early purchase discount and choose an end date for that early purchase discount. Also, you can set a limited capacity to make your event more exclusive. Click Next. You can upload a cover photo for the live event. And this is how people can view your live event and they can get access and view the details below. You can set the event settings, add co-hosts, show guest list, enable or disable, only admins can post an event, and enable people to send their questions via Messenger. Click Save, then Create Event. This window will show that our scheduled live event will start on this date and time. Once you go live on this date, you will need to set up the live video here. It will show you that this event is about to start and will be visible to guests who have paid to attend this event. If you want to go live and use a streaming software, use Stream Key. Take note of the server URL, which is the URL in your streaming software. Copy the Stream Key into your streaming software's Stream Settings. On your streaming software, access the Settings menu. Look for the Stream Settings. Under Service, choose Facebook Live, then copy the Stream Key from our Facebook Go Live Streaming Settings to this software's Stream Key field. Then click Apply. Click Start Streaming on your streaming software and you can see in this post preview that it's already connected to the software. Click Go Live. Now your audiences will see that you are live. Going live on Facebook can help you connect with your audience in real time. Your viewers can ask questions and you can answer their inquiries during your live stream. It's a good practice to announce your upcoming live streaming event so that people will know about the event and they will be online to watch and support your live event. Selling your products using Facebook Go Live is a great practice to attract more buyers to your page and more people will be aware of the products that you are selling. You can attract new followers who can be your loyal customers. People who watch your live video can view the live chat, all the users replies, and find more live videos like this. Facebook prioritizes live streaming videos, especially when it drives more engagement from your audiences. You can also include polls where you're live streaming and this drives engagement from your audiences. If you want your videos to rank high on YouTube, we have a marketing app that can help you get more traffic on YouTube. It's called Play Traffic. With Play Traffic, you can give yourself a big traffic boost from YouTube playlists. Rank for impossible keywords that you cannot rank before. Get traffic from people who are looking for playlists. Get 100% organic traffic that costs nothing. Play Traffic is a three-step playlist magic that helps you get results faster. Step 1. Get playlist topics with Play Traffic's powerful niche keyword finder. Step 2. Find and add videos with one click. And Step 3. Use just one click to publish playlists instantly or to schedule them. Try Play Traffic now. Go to playtraffic.in. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. I hope you find this video helpful. Thank you for watching. And I'll see you on the next video.